Hello, everyone. My name is Christine Abernathy from F5. And I'm Jay White from Microsoft. So um, um, a couple of years ago, um, there was uh, OpenSSF uh, put together a mobilization plan in response to what had come out of the White House related to securing our software supply chain. And out of that became uh, Education SIG, which is under the OpenSSF. OpenSSF is the Open Source Security Foundation. The best practices group was working on an education and mobilization plan. As we worked uh, into that, we thought about what this would mean for DEI, because diversity, equity, and inclusion is something that is really key and important, especially if we want to have more people who are in the workforce who come from these different backgrounds. And this matches up with the strategy that came out of the White House, where we look at if we want to actually expand the global workforce around cybersecurity, we definitely look to, need to look beyond what we traditionally look at. So. Around uh, this time last year, Christine and I got together and we actually met yeah. at the Open Summit uh, in Austin. And uh, we had um, lobster rolls. Really good, remember, right? really good. <laughs> <laughs> While we had lobster rolls, we said, how cool would it be uh, for more underrepresented communities to end up at conferences like this? Um, so to come together and, and to, to interact right in the community. There's so many uh, of us that are engineers out there that don't know about this type of thing. So what that resulted in was us asking the question, well, why aren't many of us here, right? Um, when we got together, we said, well, what can we do? And one of those things was attacking the issue from the beginning, education, right? And you'll see a couple of our goals here under our DE&I um, education subcommittee uh, where we talk about uh, making materials more accessible and then ensuring pathways to success. And looking at that first uh, bullet there, um, it's really about equity at that point, right? How is information getting out across the education spectrum? And then how is education getting out across the social spectrum, right? Um, as part of that effort, our part is to come together, bring other people together inside of our, our subcommittee, uh, for all from different walks of life, from different areas and regions of, of the world, to talk about this problem that's uh, experienced uh, globally. And through that, we get down to the second bullet, talking about ensuring pathways to success. And what does that look like? Um, We'll talk, have Christine talk about that more, but we had yeah. created a first uh, of its kind um, spreadsheet full of global organizations that are set on tackling this issue. We'd love it if you all saw it. Yeah, and uh, when you're looking at the paths to success, so there's one thing where you may get education and you get a certification, but then what happens next? Do you actually get a job? Um, do you actually find a way to actually get into the career where you can find that rewarding? So when we're looking at ensuring pathways to success, what are the partnerships we need to work with? Who are the people who are looking into mentorship opportunities? Who are the people out there who are actually investing in some of the same problems that we wanted to look at. So when we're talking about this spreadsheet, there are so many people who are working in this area. And we want to make sure that we partner with folks who are already thinking about that, who already have these, these things in place, whether it's mentorships, whether it's certification, and plugging in with them with a cybersecurity aspect. So that's where we kind of came in. And so we've started working around that. And we also want to partner with some of the other open source security foundation working groups, for example, Alpha Omega, and some of the opportunities that they may have available for some of these underrepresented groups. So those are some of the things that we're thinking thinking about. Um, along with that is making sure that we hold ourselves, hold the communities and programs that we reach out to, and hold the organizations with these kind of programs in it accountable uh, to make sure that everyone receives that effort, that information, and can find us. Here on this slide, you'll see where we meet. Yeah, um, so we definitely want you to join us. We <laughs> so yeah. much going on, and we yeah. need everyone. You see there every other Tuesday, 11 a.m. Uh, next meeting is May 23rd. We hope to see all of you there. There's our Slack channel. Um, 
And come find us also. We'll be at Open SSF Day, which is happening tomorrow. And we'll also be around all through the conference. Come meet and chat with us and give us your ideas. Thank you all very much. Thank you.